Hi everyone, I'm CBS 3 on your side consumer reporter Jim Donovan with this week's digital consumer brief. First up, the Better Business Bureau is warning consumers to watch out for scams involving Ebola. There are a range of schemes trying to take advantage of people's fears of the deadly virus. The BBB is advising people to avoid bogus personal protection kits and Ebola cures being sold online and to ignore emails with links to bogus charities claiming to help Ebola victims. Good news for potential home buyers or those looking to refund finance for the fifth straight week mortgage rates have fallen mortgage company Freddie Mac said today that nationwide average for a 30-year home loan is now 3.92 percent the lowest level since June of 2013 the average for a 15-year mortgage is just above three percent millions of older Americans will see their Social Security benefits increase next year beginning in January monthly payments will go up about 1.7 percent around 20 bucks a month get ready to pay a few more bucks if you're traveling by plane, according to FareCompare.com, Delta Airlines has raised round-trip fares by $4 on many domestic routes, and American, U.S. Airways, United, and Southwest have matched the four-buck hike. Bad news for Citibank customers, some checking account fees are going up. Starting in January, monthly fees on City Rewards checking accounts will increase from $20 to $25. Fees on basic accounts will rise from $10 to $12. Finally, Target started gearing up for the holiday season this week by offering free shipping on all items, no matter the size or cost. The company will also offer one toy at 50% off every day until the holiday. Those are the consumer headlines so far this week. Remember to follow me on Facebook and Twitter for the latest recalls, scam alerts, and travel deals. I'm CBS 3 on your side's Jim Donovan. See you on TV.